good morning everyone so today we will come with a very exciting lecture so that is on the topology so topology error correction see when we are actually going to use the topology so that you have to understand so uh, usually uh, whenever you are creating some data sets like uh, it's maybe in your polygons or the roads whatever it will be so uh, manually whenever we are trying to digitize so there should be some manual interventions will be there but if you are uh, want uh, accurate results so then you have to remove those manual errors but within suppose 10,000 or 20,000 polygons okay so which one will be the overlap or which lines will be the overshoot and undershoot so selecting those are really difficult okay so that's why uh, the topology error corrections is very important so let's try with something with the topology error corrections okay so let's go to the arcgis pro here we have one registered topo sheet suppose and i am going to use uh, this topo sheet um, for my uh, you can say the data which i'm going to create over this register topo sheet. this is the topo sheets of the part of the india it's a bihar okay so and now i am just going to create a uh, you can say i will create a geodatabase under a geodatabase we will going to create a geodata sets and under the geodata sets we will create a feature class and over the feature class we can create a you can say we will set a topology rules okay to identify the errors so that we will going to try so let's go to the catalog window and I'm just going to add a connection folder where I'm going to save the data. So this is the test one. Suppose I'm just going to save the data sets. Okay. So I will select it. I will right click it. I'll go to the new and I will create a file database. So in the database, I can give a proper name that will be a topology suppose oh, sorry very sorry under this i created this database so you can rename this okay and you can give a name as topo test okay so this is the name i provided now i am going to create one feature data sets inside this topo so i will right click on this okay i will go to this and create a feature data sets okay so whatever the feature data sets i have i'm just going to create a new feature data sets under database so feature data sets i will also give as topo testing okay so if you want you can give whatever the base maps uh, 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 predictions is there so that you can fix okay that is in predicted quantity system because my topo sheets whatever I, I i have so that is basically i can say it is in wgs 24 okay this geographic coordinate system so any one of the coordinate systems you can open create okay so no problem i will i will create any one and uh, you can go with that okay so suppose the uh, gcs now it is changed so that's why you can go with the gcs that's fine now uh, i just create run so this is the fixed okay my topology testing is actually fixed inside this particular geodatabase okay so here I'm just going to create a new feature class which name suppose I'm going to give as a forest okay so I will just right click on this go to the new and this is the feature class which we're going to create as I'm going to digitize this forest so I'm just giving a name as a forest forest then give copy paste it and this is the polygon okay so i'm just getting as a polygon so just simply go to the next so if you want to create a field like you can give as a name 
okay name of the forest i will not create any more okay just simply show you so it is by default fixed as a w74 the selection which i given it here so go to the next 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 and click on the finish so now this forest came so if you want to digitize this forest inside this uh, topology testing under the uh, jura sets this is a forest so if you want to start digitizing you can go to the edit file so the edit me tab and click on the create so you can start digitizing it so i'll just zoom it and i will just arbitrarily doing one poly suppose this is the one polygon and intentionally i will do one more polygon which will be overlap of this poly okay so i will just doing polygon suppose the forest which will be the overlap now i want to see this overlap area should seen or visible in the topology red collections so let's see how we're going to do that so before that i will go to save this whatever the editing i did now if you want to create a rule or you can create a topology so from from, from, from where you are going to create a topology so that is if you go back to catalog so this is your topology testing okay so this is your feature data set so always topology you need to create over the feature data sets so just simply right click on this okay now click on the new and here you have that options to create a topology so click on the topology so now here you need to set a certain rule okay for your topology you need to set a certain rule this name suppose topology testing underscore topology so that is by default the name which is created i will go with that i didn't change anything so over which feature class you want to run the topology so you need to select here so that means here we can get a multiple so if i create a multiple layers under this topology so multiple options i can able to select at the same time I can create a multiple rules also okay so select i will just going to select this forest one okay so the forest one which i want i just simply select it okay and we can go to the next to fix our rule for running this topology so i will just go to the next okay so to set my rules on that okay so i will now fix a proper rule to to identifying those errors okay so uh, in this first thing feature class it which we will going to select here that is a forest okay next we have to select the rules so i will come back to the rules so you just see here there is a lot of different rules will be there so which rule is ap applicable here that is must not overlap area must not overlap area so this is the rule i am selecting for this rule set okay now if i want i can just simply click uh, uh you can say if you want to create uh, any more um, rule set over here so you can give multiple rule set also simply clicking here and you can set multiple rule sets for you polygons that errors which you are identifying okay so now uh, my rules is ready okay so if i go again next so nothing is need to change over here okay so here you just click on the finish to set your topology and you just see after this the topology will come on inside this geo data set okay so if i just refresh and you see under this a new topology is created clear so now what you need to do you need to add this topology okay inside your this map okay so simply right click and add to the current map 
and you see your new topology will add it to your map okay so we can go for the next step okay so now adding this topology here okay so what you have to do now you have to uh, now go to the edit tab okay in ArcGIS Pro edit tab you see here this is the edit tab and from this manage edits you see this is the manage edits okay and you need to select the topology tab okay so this is the topology tab you just click on this down arrow and whatever the map topology you've just created now so that you need to select okay so this is your map topology which you have to select now sorry not map topology the topology testing topology database which you created so that you need to select to run your topology error so let's see let's what we need to do okay so uh, let's go to this um, topology tab and uh, we can see how to create a map topology one so this is the map topology i'm just clicking on that okay so here you have the error inspector now you click on the error inspector so this will come up okay now now in this error inspector you see there is one option is called validate so if you click the validate okay so the errors it will going to show you here okay understand it is clear so once i will fix my topology as a map topology then i will click on this error inspector and this error inspector window will come up and there you have to validate whatever the rule you set so the rule is must not overlap so once i click the validate so the area which is overlap so that it is actually showing to me okay so this is actually directly showing me to that so this will not so this is the preview if you see the details okay it will show you the details and if you want to fix so see it will show you take you to that particular locations okay and it will suggest you also means what process you have to use and you can click that so it will ask you to which to what first one to first two you want to match or first two the first one you want to match so select any one and click on the match so your that error will dissolve so this is the proper way to utilize your topology rules to correcting your data so whatever you are actually doing so that if you want to save you can save so that will change over your map okay so this is the process of doing the topology correction and topology corrections we are applied for various purpose not only over the polygon same types of rules you can set for the lines for overshoot and undershoots okay we can create a topology for that also so i hope it will be a very interesting lecture for everyone so if you like this video please share my channel and video with others and subscribe my channels okay and give your comments how you like this video and what kind of topics you want to see thank you thank you very much